Hey guys, today we have an interesting announcement and we can just let the comment section go wild because it's either going to, in my opinion, it'll be fetches or filters as the best case scenario and then some really crappy, maybe pain lands as the worst case scenario, the ally pain lands. So from the full deck list, once, when the full deck list become available, you may notice that we did something unusual with the mana base. We normally don't put rare dual lands in commander pre-constructed decks. We prefer to put those car types of cards into products intended for a wider audience, which is meant to sell booster packs or master products. We know that four color decks presented a special challenge for getting access to all your colors of mana. We, so we spent some time identifying rare dual lands that we didn't think we'd want to put into booster packs in the near future. We put a few of those cards into the Commander 2016 decks to help the decks run smoothly. Definitely going to be a reprint. The reason it's going to be a reprint is because there's only 56 new cards. I cannot imagine them wasting 5 or about 10% of the new cards on new land. So what do you expect? It could be enemy fetch lands, best case scenario. It could also be the filter lands and you would get all 10 of those, right? So I don't know, I'm very excited because this again is something that they don't typically do. And whatever the card is, its price will plummet into oblivion. So leave me a comment below if you have a guess as what it is, I really hope it is enemy fetch lands, but I honestly cannot imagine that happening. I think the best, the ceiling would be filter lands, which are very expensive, but we're probably going to get something a lot cheaper. Maybe the ping land cycle again, there's 10 of them. I don't know. It would be pretty cool to see the fast lands back or the man lands even though they are part of standard currently. I really don't know because the cycle has to be rare. And I'm thinking it could be fetch lands, but I don't want to get my hopes up too much because obviously some of the fetch lands cost quite a bit of money. Anyway, leave me a comment below what you think the dual lands will be, and we'll guess we will find out soon. Bye, guys.